Hi guys, Adam here. I'm with Andy. We're outside the Bet365. I know it feels good right now. We got that late goal. First, Firstly, talk to me about that goal because these lot in the comments wouldn't allow me to go past Wayne Rooney's record-breaking 250th goal. You you witnessed history, Andy. I did witness history, um, but uh, see, when he came on, the cameras went to Bobby Charlton. I witnessed history and I'm proud of for him. I really am proud of him. But this is two points dropped. Again, I get, w w Stoke had two, was it two shots on target and it was an own goal from De Gea. They did nothing today. But uh, like I say, Jose's installed this never say die attitude and I'm proud of that and I'm glad we've got that. But this is another two points dropped. And um, I, it's a point gained on City, point gained on Liverpool, but with their result, it should be free. And um, it's uh, regrettable. He should have. He shouldn't have played for Lena. He should have. He should have gone with Marcel on a bit of attack. No, no attacking up till about the last 20 minutes. United started to throw everything forward. Pogba was a little bit hit and miss. He what? I think he was trying too hard today. Um, when Rashford come on, there was a bit of pace in there. And like I have to say, when Rooney come on, that, I was right behind that free kick and. Um, I didn't expect it, but he did it, and we've we've got out of jail last two games now. So it's a bit of mix. It's a mixed emotions. I'm proud. I'm happy. I'm chuffed for him. He, he's a Man United legend now. Nothing can dispute that. But we're dropping points, and like you say, I don't want this to be proof costly coming the end of the season. Um, do you think this kind of those show though that although Jose has got us grinding out results when we maybe don't deserve them? that maybe there is a little bit something missing from this team? Or, again, was it the fact that we just didn't put our chances away? Juan Mata probably had the worst 45 minutes of his whole life in that first half. Scores, well, you said it was De Gea, it could have been Mata. Um, it come off both of them. He misses that opportunity. Maybe the own goal's playing on his mind. Mas like, was it the missed chances or is there just something missing? Is there still a bit of Van Arlism maybe in there? No, 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 because if you're like, that, Mata puts that away in the first half, his chance. That was a guilt-ridden chance. It was a beautiful ball from Zlatan. It was just guilt. It was begging to be, to be put in. But after like, the United didn't start playing till like the 30th minute, and you, you, United have got to be on on the on the game from the word go. And uh, there's nothing about Van Gaal in that team now. Everything's been eradicated. Like you say, it's brushed from history. But it's it, United. There was no urgency to like the 70th minute. And he changed it, and he changed this, and changed that. But we we got out of jail, and we, we just have to be satisfied with that. We have gone one point close to Liverpool, <laughs> silver lining maybe. Um, we haven't lost since November the third. We do need to start turning these draws into wins now. But Zlatan today as well. He's there's times there where I'm thinking he's going to shoot, and he just dilly dallies and don't. First half he had a chance. He should have absolutely smashed it, and he plays it off to the side for someone else to shoot. He should have put it in, but... A bit of tiredness creeping in, maybe, or... He might six be. Six days since the last game. Oh, you can't have excuses now. Because uh, if you look at... If you look at these last two games, it, they may be beneficial coming the end of the season because Stoke's a tough place to come. We know they're from last season, previous experiences. I can't remember last time we won here, to be fair. 2013. That was a League Cup match, wasn't it? Something. <laughs> All in that hail and the snow. I was there for that, uh, but... Yeah, it's, it's a tough place to go. We've got a run of games now, which is winnable. I say we've got Hull, we've got Leicester, we've got Middlesbrough, uh, I think Sunderland as well, and we, we have to go on another winning run now. So if we can go into them, come out. Do you think maybe that, that point against Liverpool kind of stopped the momentum? I know it didn't stop them beating run, but you think it kind of halted the momentum a little bit? Yeah, the momentum's been stopped because, like I say, bef before the six, six straight wins, we we were we were we were in well where we are now just drawing games and nothing was going in but it's just a, it's just a blip and it's like a bump in the road and we will get there but it's it's oh you just really this is motions after the game what will Jose be saying to the players fingers might be pointed everyone's praising Rooney but then players will know and Jose will know this was two points dropped tonight man of the match. It's a bit hard to say. I give it Rooney because he's made the record. He's done the record. I can't fault him for that. But there, there was nobody else on the pitch. Cheers, man.